Fowler. I hope you are well. It is finally Friday as well. We've got that as bonus. It's Christmas Eve, so it's going to be Christmas tomorrow. It doesn't feel like Christmas, though. So tomorrow, it's going to be like, oh, wake up. We're like, oh, Merry Christmas. Yeah, okay. Literally, Christmas for me, it's just a, no a normal day. Just a normal day. You know, you just, you just open presents and shit, you know. It's not like I'm very aggressive at, at all. I mean, oh, it's a big fucking hassle, isn't it? It's fine. Presents for people and etc. X, Y, and Z. But enough about that. Santa is on his way. Because I'll be watching out for him. Kill that fat bastard. <laughs> I really care if any kids are watching. I won't kill Santa. But uh, that's where we're currently loading. I'd like to say thank you for watching the two. You can leave a like and favourite and subscribe as well. You can like and follow me on Facebook and Twitter as well. You can follow me on Twitch and Follow me on Twitch and Instagram. My, my mind went blind now because for some reason my controller vibrated, but I don't know why. But I thought the um, G game loaded up, but it did not. But um, but if you, as well, if you do subscribe, uh, you click that little bell and you will get notified when I upload a video, which is normally Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, unless I'm ill, away, or Generally, I do some I just do forget. I'm only human, I should it's just it just slips my mind or I'll get distracted by something and just like, like that. But also, as we're still loading, because I'll probably sorry for recording this way too early in the in this loading screen. Oh, maybe not. Oh, there you go, there's a couple of vibrate and the little shimmy shape. Uh, where did we leave off? Uh, oh, yeah, we're in this. Oh. I'm on the right track. That keep is well protected. It was. God's name. Blowing up and everything blowing up and catching on fire. Oh, yeah, so this is where we go up to. The king or the lord, and the lord basically he did. Actually, I thought I was going to do this last episode. All is prepared. Shall we begin the washing? Hey, who comes? Welcome, stranger. Are you here to pay tribute to our Lord Elderman? Yeah. 
Your elderman is long past the days of good conversation. Yet still, he makes good company. I've been instructed to wash and prepare his earthly vessel. Instructed by whom? Soldiers. They brought him here as he protested, feebly. I did my best to make him comfortable, until he slipped away. Um... Hoonwald deserves to know the truth about his father's fate. He's owed an inheritance and deserves a chance to become Elderman himself. All in good time, I imagine. No, now. When the guards put him in my care, I was told to keep all this a secret. Until the appointed time. When I asked who gave these orders, they struck me. I wish I could say more. I have seen all I need to, but Hunwald will need proof. Of course. You're welcome to search through his effects. Though I'm not sure what trinket would best serve your purpose. I'll find something. Bring him in his head. That's fine, that would do. Dried herbs and berries, crushed into powder. The time between my lord's departure and his burial is... longer than usual. My lord must keep up appearances for his upcoming rites. Um, I think you can stop the video if you want to be that. A box of musty clothing and a brooch with a crest. The house of the ferocious swan. This will do. I'll return this brooch to Hunwald in Lincoln. I hope the poor boy can withstand such ill news. Foul rat droppings everywhere. Even in death, my lord is a friend to all of God's creatures. Take care. And you. I shall take you to your family crypt at Nettleham within Lincoln. There, you may lay beside your forebearers, the great and glorious kings of old Lindsay. Please, do not desecrate our lord. I am Dane, not a cruel grief monger. I do not know what this is, and I'd rather not ask. Yes. I thought the same. Troubling. goes down so basically we've got a brooch so we need to return brooch said brooch to the lord Absence of an elderman. The quest that we're doing. Okay. If it's a time being wave, I mean, people moving in 
Hopefully he won't be there later on. And again, yeah, as soon as I complete the complete the door, I think I'll just get rid of the game on my PlayStation. And possibly try something else if I can. I don't know what though. That's the only issue now completing this game is I don't know what to play at afterwards. Okay, I'm coming out, and then... Need to cloak myself here. And later, I'll have that. We'd lose. Following that, so we would actually... Go as we please. Is that I think this won't be the, 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 the last mission for him. I think he'll want to know who the soldiers ordered by. I reckon it's them too, possibly, too late, but don't trust them. Eivor! What news? Your father is dead. Wait, what? The sigil of Hunbeor's house. I found it near his body. No. No, this cannot be. I've probably been using the wrong fucking strong. microphone as well. <laughs> Typical. He cannot be gone. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, you poor boy. I'm so, so sorry. I am a man, Archer! Do you hear me? I am a man and I am my father's son! Do not forget it! That a son has lost his father is always a cause for sadness. But your shire has also lost its elderman. That is a cause for worry, and often war. I'm sorry, Hunwald. I had already asked a priest to administer last rites when your father disappeared. What? I didn't tell you sooner because I... I thought by some miracle he had survived. You lied to me! You silly, sobbing mooncalf. Will you never grow up? Lord have mercy on that woman. She should have said something. It was her duty to say something. Hunwal was the son of an elderman. Will he take his father's seat? The title's not hereditary, but he can plead his case before a shire moot. King Chaelwulf must then ratify the decision. Explain how this works, your Shire Moot. A moot is a meeting of lords. We convene from time to time to steer the course of our Shire. It was always my intention to convene a moot, but between our troubles in Lincoln and the bandits' raids, we slipped into a pattern of convenience. Someone in the Shire wants Hunwald dead. If I have to assemble an army to make sure this meeting is not an ambush, I will. The Shire Mood is a lawful, godly assembly. 
Unwild will be safe, as will you be. Apart from Hunwald, who else will stand for the Elderman's seat? If I may be so bold, I should like to put my name forward. Under my care, this Shire has found some peace this past month. I will offer my name as well. My family has ancient ties to this land. And I am proud to say I have forged quite a friendship with the Danes to the north. Good. My priests will spread word of the moot across the Shire and will convene in a few days' time. Uh, do visit my estate, Eivor. I have something for you. Something I think you'll enjoy. I'll find the time. Eivor, a word if you don't mind. Is the word Christ or pagan? Oh, I deeply regret my churlish ways when we first met. I did not treat you as my god commands, with kindness and love. Love is a difficult feeling to command. Yes, quite. In any case, thank you for putting this mystery to rest. I do hope we'll see you at the moot. At the moot. So him and... Guy, With now, Hunbeor's death an open secret, Hunwald's enemies may strike again. I should find him before they do. Archer went to console him. I should follow her. these now, you know, like the way of the bay, it increases my attacks. is the nearest. Archer, where is Hunwald? I tried to console him, but he pushed me away. I love the boy, I do. But I fear what would happen if he took his father's title. He's fragile and scattered. I saw him ride north, following the paved Roman road, to the old tall tree where he often passed time with his father, I imagine. What devil put you up to all this deception? I wasn't put up, Eivor. I felt compelled to carry on for the good of the Shire. Until I knew the truth. A pretty answer for an ugly lie. I must beg forgiveness from my god. The Lord lifts up the meek. We must praise him. What's going on? <laughs>
flats or whatever she was called. Please, this is a mistake. The, uh... I've told you my name is not Hunwa. Old tree. Well, it's going to be the <coughs> biggest one as well. These woods, father. Oh, these woods. I remember the days we spent here together. <laughs> uh, hello, Avor. Is that you, Avor? What a pleasant surprise. Would you drink with me? Unwald. Come, s sit, sit. Stay with me a while and contemplate. Contemplate. Contemplate the view. Be easy with your grief, Unwald. If you're not careful, it's a poison you'll bear in your blood for the rest of your life. No need to worry. <clears throat> for I have found the antidote for it. <laughs> Beer. No Do alcohol. Not on grief, nor give in to sadness. But let your aching love light the mead of your eyes and lead you to triumph. That is quite lovely. My father would have liked you. He liked all those who could swing a sword and speak a verse with ease. He had a large heart and a love for his people. I think I would have liked him too. <laughs> he and I used to wander up this way all the time. He would take me hunting. And I would catch the most wretched little things if I caught anything at all. I was a rubbish hunter. <laughs> but he always said he was proud. Each and every time. A toast. To your father, Lord Hunbeorth of Lincolnshire. He may have dwindled from this world in death. But in life he was as stalwart as this tree. A wise old oak. Yes. Skull. Skull. What does skull mean cheers? And then my father says, it's the right goat, but it's the wrong end. <laughs> 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 oh, my Swanborough loves that one. <laughs> she has a great sense of humor, my lady love. Father would have liked her. Right. Your Dane lady love. She sounds lovely. Too lovely to be real. You know what? We should visit her. We should go to Brimsky. Uh, gr Grimsby. Yes, yes, there's no time Grinsby. to lose. After you. Go to Grinsby. Nothing like drinking and riding to jostle your troubles away. And the contents of your gut. Am I drunk as well? 
now come and enjoy the splendor of my shire. You Saxons and your tiny splendor. You have never seen mountains, have you? Or deep fjords like a giant's axe wound. Or towering falls that steam in the dead of winter. Snow sparkling like a blanket of jewels. That is splendor. Well, if your homeland is so splendor... ...full, why come to England at all? You cannot grow crops on a blanket of jewels. <laughs> Very true. I'll admit, your countryside does take the breath away. Quite so, quite so. I love this land. And should I follow my father's footsteps, I shall do my solemn duty to protect them. I know many think me foolish and experienced, but I would ask that they judge me by my future hopes, not my past reputation. If I am given sway over this land and show myself to be a poor leader, show me, punish me, of course, but give me that chance. My God, I just want to have that chance. I don't know why I killed that deer, but it's just standing still. So I might as well have killed it. Got free leather out of it. What was that? Birds, Eivor! Has no one told them today is a day of grief? Shh. Quiet. Stop here. Something isn't right. I'll find the trouble before it finds us. Eivor, I am sweating from pit to toe. Do not leave me here. Hush. Stay calm. There, that's the one. Now. You to stay. Eva told you to stay there. Devils! Who sent you? Speak or be damned! Four one four. Nice. God's justice awaits, coward! Still eliminate the threat. How can there be a threat if there's no one here? Is if I have to go to them. That's twice they tried to kill you, Hunwald. And twice failed! We had luck, but if you're not more careful, they will succeed. Someone in Mercia wants you dead, and they'll kill anyone in the way to see it done. Yes! Including my dear Swanborough! 
My lady love. Come, let us hurry away. I am serious, Hunwald. Are you hearing me? Plain and clear. Follow me. Hunwald, are you sure this place is safe? The safest spot in the Shire, yes. Here I am with a chance to be Elderman, but I have yet to prove myself worthy. To you, to the Shire, to her. I can do nothing without my darling lady. You've made me realize how much I've neglected her through this fatal stupor of mine. This I must see for myself. At least you're not drunk anymore, I guess. Not if he is still drunk. Like a heat from a distance. But if it's a shade, then fair enough. Hundval, I thought for sure you'd be dead. Why didn't you send word? It has been far too long, my little jewel. I'm so very sorry for that. I'm fine, my love. I wilted without you, but still I grow. And who is this? Ah, yes. I am proud to present Eivor of the Raven Clan. Hello, Eivor. A pleasure to meet you. And you, Swanborough. I wasn't sure what to make of Hunwald's stories, yet here you are. Surprised to find the Dane by his side? Not quite. I'm surprised to find a Saxon at yours. Hunwald seems to endear himself to all sorts. Eivor agreed to help me find my father. But I'm afraid it hasn't gone as well as I'd hoped. What's happened? My father is dead. Died of a cruel disease, apparently. Then shunted off to a cellar for burial. Oh, my love, I'm sorry. And someone in your shire wants to make sure Hunwald follows his father to the grave. Let them try. I'll cut their throats. A Shiremood will soon be held. Hunwald should stay here out of sight until he can attend. What if I left it all behind, my love? Forget my father's seat. What if I stayed here with you? Just the two of us. Hunwald, no. The Shire must be led with courage and heart. Follow in your father's footsteps and lead the Shire as he did. Whatever strength you lack, you have in Swanborough. Heed her advice. Yes. If anyone can lift my spirits in time for the Shire moot, it's you, my dear. Come inside and rest your fumbling bones, love. Be well, Eivor, and thank you. You're welcome, I guess. Keep watch over that one. Men have come for him more than once. My blade will keep him safe. I do not doubt it. more skill points just before we end. time we go up and that will start light damage heavy damage what about that stealth damage so it's good well it's stealth okay oh, 
Okay. <laughs> it's like a pickpocketing, but where did that fucking ask about pickpocketing? Truly honest. Ability damage. Ability damage does help a little bit. Sprint attack. Really, assassination damage, that can be useful. Stealth, melee damage. Yeah, that's stealth. Probably need to go down this route over here, far to the right. It's a hammer stuff. What the hell's that? Evil automatically performs. A roll when landing from dangerous heights, reducing the amount of damage taken. Okay. How do I get that? I need to go down here. Oh. Last chance healing. So I, I'm gonna okay. I'm gonna end it here because I'm gonna get distracted by all this. So I'm going to say thank you for watching, you can leave a like and favourite and subscribe as well, you can like and follow me on Facebook and Twitter as well, you can follow me on Twitch and Instagram if you so wish. So I've been a super other gamer, it's been Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Uh, probably won't upload until possibly the new year, so have a good Christmas and have a also a good new year. Goodbye. But, okay.